So in this video, we'll discuss picking a colored card or a ball from a pack kind of questions. So when you are given a question like this, the first thing that we need to observe is he's picking two balls and he's picking both the balls at once. Okay. And now let's look at the sample space. So there are eight red balls and four white balls. So 12 balls altogether. Out of these 12, I need to pick two. So these are the total number of ways that we have. Let's now look at the favorable outcomes. Because he's talking about both the balls being red, there are eight red marbles. So out of these eight marbles, I need to select two. Therefore, the probability favorable outcomes by sample space. On expanding 8C2 and 12C2, we can strike off the 2 and this is 4 2s, 4 3s. So we are left out with 14 with 33 and that is the answer. And like the previous question, he is picking 2 marbles. And both the marbles are drawn at once. And this time he is asking both the marbles should be of the same color. He did not specify which color. So let's start off by taking the sample space. There are 6 white marbles and 4 black marbles. So that 10 altogether. And out of these 10 we need to select and now the favorable outcomes. So he just said both the marbles should be of same color. He did not specify which color in particular. So maybe both the marbles are of white color or both the marbles are of black color. Either this can happen or this can happen. So out of six white marbles we need to select two or out of four black marbles we need to select two. Therefore the probability 6C2 or means it's a plus and 4C2 by the sample space which is 10C2. On expanding these, 6C2 is 15, 4C2 is 6 and 10C2 is 45. That becomes 21 by 45 and let's strike this off with 3 7s and 3 15s so we get 7 by 15 and that is the answer. And this time we are picking two chairs and we don't want those chairs to be white because there are 3, 5 and 4 that's 12 chairs altogether. And out of these 12, we need to select 2. So 12C2 is the sample space. So we don't want a white chair, but the chair can be brown or it can be black. And there are 3 brown and 5 black, so there are 8 chairs altogether. Out of these 8, I need to select 2. It means that both the chairs can be black or both the chairs are brown or one is black and the other one is brown. Now if you look at the probability 8C2 by 12C2 on expanding and striking this with 4 we get 14 by 33. And even in this question, two roses are drawn at once. But this time, we don't want them to be of the same color. 
and the best way to solve not of the same color is to take the total probability and subtract the opposite of the condition given in the question. So not of the same color, we will take same color and subtract that from the total probability. If you ask me, can we directly do it by taking one rose to be red and the other one to be yellow and so on? Absolutely, you can do it like that, but this is a much better approach. So the total probability is one and if they have to be of the same color, I pick two roses, uh, sorry, there are two red roses and we pick two out of them or four yellow roses and we select two out of them or out of six pink, we select two out of them. Out of an overall sample space of 12, we select two. And on expanding these values, so this is 2C2 is one, 4C2 is six, and 6C2 is 15, by 12C2, which is 66. And that becomes 22 by 66, or that is one by three, so 1 minus 1 by 3, which is 2 by 3. And the last question from the segment. So in this, you need to pick a bag. And from the bag, you need to pick a red card. So let's select a bag first. There are two bags and the probability of selecting the first one is one by two. And in the first one, we need to select a red card. So there's seven cards altogether and there are four red cards. Or the probability of selecting the second bag is one by two. And in this bag, we have six cards. And red cards are two in number. Strike off the two here and this as well. And if I have to simplify this, this is 2 by 7 or means a plus and this is 1 by 6. LCM is 42. So that is 12 and 7, which is 19 by 42. Thank you so much for watching.